February, uh, one of the aspects that I got feedback on that the participants actually really appreciated was um, talking about my first competition, which was uh, Fame 2005, the East Show once again, uh, saying how I was reading on all the info on the website and that it was quite complete, but there were a few areas that maybe could have been enhanced a little bit, well, just from my own personal knowledge. Uh, for example, no posing oils and stuff like that. So I came in and I had this really dark tan and I had gotten some coaching from a woman who had competed like in the 80s when it first started out. So she's like, get some Gentana. Like, not to knock Gentana, but obviously the one that I bought didn't react well with my skin tone because I came out like green and it was dark and it just wasn't a pretty color. And of course, I see no posing oils or tanning um, or, or creams and stuff. So I'm like, so I was super matte, super dark, all kind of streaky and stuff. <laughs> showed up on stage like that and the girls are in the backstage and they've got their pan out and their shimmer creams and I was like wow what's that they're like no no you can use all this stuff to kind of make a little shine and shimmer they just don't want oils and I was like oh great so all that to say don't come out with matte test your tanning products before you get to the venue and uh, when you get on the stage just have fun when I got there I felt kind of like a deer caught in the headlights because I really didn't know what to expect again the coaching I had gotten wasn't quite relative to the fitness model uh, stage, if you will. So I just went out there and I won it. I had fun, strutted my stuff, did a couple little poses. I let my dance background kind of kick in and just let my personality shine through. And out of about 35, 40 participants, I placed second. So you never know. One of the advantages to coming to the fame camps are to avoid some of the mishaps that I incurred <laughs> during my first show. Um, and once I placed second, I was like, wow, I did pretty good considering that I didn't get much coaching. So that's when I ended up going to the Bat Cave and um, getting more, you know, getting my diet on point, getting my tanning on point, getting my posing on point. Um, and those are a lot of the aspects that we're going to cover during the camp. So how to walk, how to bring out your personality, um, what the judges are looking for, um, what the judges are looking for for a fame stage as well, because it'll also vary from federation to federation. Um, so that's it. This is to give you constructive criticism and to know what to anticipate, so that way um, you're that much ahead of the game. And you'll notice that from last night, there are about three or four of the ladies that placed in top three in the categories out of uh, some of the participants who entered my uh, camp.